Yo, what's up, guys? Today we're watching TMNT 2012. And if you want us to watch more of this show or other TMNT stuff, then get this video to 15,000 likes. Yo, subscribe so you don't miss the next video. You see, this is the reason why people liked TMNT growing up. This one specifically is because look at the action scenes, okay? Cam in the action scene. You don't get that in every version. We're not watching Nickelodeon for no reason. What? That guy's character design doesn't look that bad. Oh, his skin is so gross looking. Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. Turtles that have shell. Turtle power. I hope it's revealed that it's like a Coca-Cola advertisement and it's just Mountain Dew made them into the Ninja Turtles. What am I supposed to feel towards that? The problem here is that they're not recording TikToks while they're doing these crazy stunts. Well, this was back in parkour times, back when people just jumped from buildings for fun, and then they get hurt once and never do it again because holy fuck, that was a very dangerous thing. <laughs> it was a good time, man. This somehow looks like a killer bean tech demo. I think you said that last time. Jack, I understand. I agree with you. The show does not look that good. Like, I understand you look at this little cat's eyes and you just want to pop them out of its head. I want to burn it like a fucking Funko Pop, bro. I want to squeeze it till its eyes don't, don't appear anymore in this world. We have to treat this like Ruby, okay? I understand the visuals suck, but we got to give it a chance. Humans will never understand you. Heck! We don't even understand you. That's such a terrible thing to say. <laughs> no one in your life will understand you ever. That was Loki kind of cruel. Oh my god. And hey, Raphael's a hashtag savage, bro. Look at this mean fucking light skin stare right now. He's ready to slap this motherfucker. And look, he's in town for a martial arts expo. Chris, this is just Chuck Norris, is it not? Chuck Norris reference. Ninjas in New York? Other than us? Ninjas in New York? I thought they were in Paris. What are you? Do you think like they had to position the camera like on the tip of his c to get that angle? I think the cameraman had to be very precise. You don't want to assure your victory. No, I do, but... Ow! Hey! What is happening? We're witnessing child abuse right now. Seek victory not fairness oh that's interesting advice kick your bully in the balls that's low-key kind of base though is it <gasps> chris bradford's on here it's like jacking off the computer because he's imagining it's chris bradford bro mikey people don't always respond to me was that a myspace they're fucking myspace in 2012. where are you going hey to hang out with my friend. He's about to get groomed on the internet. Oh my god, TMNT was ahead of its time, question mark. It's more like psycho fans, because he got added as a friend, one of his thousands of friends on MySpace or whatever. Now he's like, I gotta go meet up with my friend. We're friends now. Yeah, Chris Yikes. Bradford about to be Chris Hansen real quick, but to pull up on Mikey thinking that he's a fucking profile. It's about victory. Okay, I'm sorry. And then, and then Chris Bradford. Oh my God. This is just Spider-Gwen talking about Kobe. Someone sounds jealous. You just can't admit that you were the R word. <laughs> what? This does not age well. I <laughs> <laughs> Guess who's going to jail tonight, bro? Mikey. <sighs> Michelangelo, Mikey, the big M. How you doing, buddy? Why doesn't he just tell him the fuck off? Chuck Norris has so many fans in 2012, he doesn't need this. He has so many mutated turtle friends. Oh, I named all six of my toes. How interesting. Oh. Why was there a fart? fart emoji? What? what? What the fuck? I'm so lost as to why there was a fart sound effect there. If you told me that I'd be watching Chuck Norris groom Michelangelo from the Ninja Turtle as he makes fart noises and touches his feet, I would be really excited to wake up this morning. I'm not going to lie. I'd be really excited to wake up next morning. But getting back to your sensei. Look, Rad Brad, I'd love to tell you. Rad Brad, that was a gaming YouTuber. How do you think of the Rad Brad feels about this episode? Considering he actually is a YouTuber, and this episode is about a guy named the Rad Brad grooming a fan right now. Do you think the person who wrote this episode had, like, something out for the Rad Brad on the, YouTube? He's, like, the most inoffensive YouTuber of all time. He just does <laughs> normal Let's Plays, but one guy hated his fucking Borderlands Let's Play and was fucking pissed. Did you plan me a surprise party? 
so Chuck Norris was Master Shredder all along? Chuck Norris hangs out with a black guy? Chuck Norris has one black friend. That's why Mikey's scared, because Mikey's secretly a fucking racist. You actually thought someone like me could be friends with a freak like you. Pathetic. <laughs> it looks like he looks like a Star Wars, the Clone Wars character. He kind of looks like Obi-Wan Kenobi from the Star Wars, the Clone Wars, like Cartoon Network series. What? 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 That was a pro tractor. Uh, I consider that more of an amateur tractor. <laughs> that was a joke I'd make. This is so scary. I'm on the edge of my seat right now. Oh, they hung them? Oh my god, mass suicide. Mass suicide? They killed them. That's not what suicide is. No, but they just dissed them so much that they wanted to kill themselves. The Ninja Turtles didn't even attack them. And if they did attack them, editor, don't include that in the video so this makes sense. I'm very sorry and I apologize for the inconvenience of me not giving up. Uh, what the fuck? They're going to a water treatment plant. They're going to be chemically treated and killed and drowned. They could have gotten information out of those guys, but they just washed them down the toilet so they can show up later. Thanks, Raph. Anytime. And then he gets a new friend, Dan Schneider. Yo, <laughs> don't say that, bro. Don't say that. You want a Nickelodeon show? Dude, he took DMT? Oh, Michelangelo, you have to take the DMT. I can see a game Mikey takes ketamine. How many times have I told you not to skateboard in the lair? None, Sensei. I shouldn't have to tell you! Wait, he's angry at something he didn't tell them to do? What? He's angry for no reason and they are so submissive to their father that they're just bending to his will. What's wrong what? with skateboarding? It's good as exercise teaches their abilities for spatial recognition. Balance. And being wicked sweet. I can't believe we're stuck down here for a whole week. Guys! Guys! You want to see what I made? Shut up, Carl. Hear me out. What if you watch Plan Sheen instead of this show? Like, that would be <laughs> awesome, guys. No. Really? But I really love the episode when Carl Weezer is an alien. Who wants to try it? I do. Toss me the teapot. Tide pod? The teapot? Turtle pod teapod. Oh, it's like an iPod. Oh, not Tide Pod. My bad. They definitely sold these, man. They were like, we'll make you like iPod nano cases for your team and T show. These Look are like this. the AliExpress turtle earbuds and they sound like fucking garbage. Make it stop! Make it stop! Thanks. Oh, he's discovering hip hop. Hey, yo. Okay. That's he's pulling out some of the light skin moves. Is that light skin? You guys remember when skateboarding was cool? And I know there's gonna be that one person that says, no, skateboarding still is cool, but that's like- That's me, that's me. It's not, okay? Like, X Games used to be fucking huge. Now they gotta get, like, esports at X Games or whatever. I don't even know what the fuck X Games is anymore. I just think street skating is cool. Yeah, but I feel like it was so much bigger back then. Just yeah. because it's not big, it doesn't make it cool, bro. Did I say it wasn't cool? I feel like I'm really insane. Are you serious? I have bad short-term memory, bro. Let me <laughs> it's cooler because it's not popular, I like you. <laughs> Why you need a roast kid? So Why you got a roast kid in chat? I think spilling the milk viewers are the most popular in their school. <laughs> Are you kidding? Fart noise. Fart noise sound effect. I don't know why, but we needed it. Now this guy really looks like he belongs in Planet Sheen. In recent news, four teenagers assault an old black man. Is that the moral of this episode that skateboarding can be used to assault people? No, no, no. They put him in the trash can, they close it. Then the trash truck comes, picks up the trash, puts him in, crushes his bones and flesh in a very grotesque manner. And then we hear the sound effects and it's like fart sound effects because it's still a cartoon. I'm sorry. Huh? What? What the what? fuck? What? What the fuck? What? Donnie made the teapot goes. from military technology, dudes. That still doesn't make any sense. If I took like a military computer and took out enough parts to make a fucking toaster, that wouldn't mean if I plugged the toaster into a tank, it would make it a super powered tank. That's so in insane. It would just make some banger ass bagels, bro. We have to get off this planet. No. But Captain! This is the best part of the show, what the fuck? 
We interrupt this program to bring you breaking news. Oh. Why would they interrupt the children's cartoon with local news? That's a very valid question. We, we interrupt this children's broadcast to give you trauma and fear. I am the Sutinator. Oh, that's terrible. Captain punch you oh my god kill this man right now please lock him up just for that mustache alone bro dude you know how many children probably hurt themselves because they saw michelangelo using nunchucks as a kid not enough all my life people have laughed at me all my life i got money in paris dude that'd be fucking awesome if you started rapping <laughs> What's happening? He turned into a toaster. Always follow me. Stop being paranoid and just do it. Pink he looks like a fucking general appliance now. He looks so ridiculous. He looks like my air fryer. I'm not gonna <laughs> lie. It's like POV. It's 3 a.m. and your air fryer woke up and it's starting to attack you. <laughs> That's just like a really, really shitty Blumhouse movie. The first rule of being a ninja is do no harm. Wait. Well, that doesn't really make sense. Didn't in the last episode he said fight your enemies until you have victory? But now in this episode he's saying don't harm people. So what is he talking about here? <laughs> Yo, are they making, like, smoked turtle stew right now? Can I get some of that, bro? Okay, Cor, if someone gave you turtle stew and they said that the character Michelangelo was cooked alive and inside that bowl right now, would you? I would eat it without a honest? second thought. I would slurp the whole thing down and lick my fingers clean. Bees! You're the bee's knees. What a fucking weird way to beat him. Where did they find a bee? Did he go all the way to like Central Park and then find a bee's nest? What the fuck is this? No, no! Now it's a tie. Now he can't be arrested because the cops won't fight him again. And he can go back to doing crime again immediately after. Stop putting people in the trash. Just can they not do like the Spider-Man thing where they tie him up and like say to the police or like how? I don't know, man. Oh my god, these guys look amazing. They don't necessarily look like robots. They look more like toy robots. Like toy robot figures that I want to go to the store and get my mom to pay lots of money for. It kind of reminds me of like the old like Game Boy transparent controllers and like the GameCube yeah. controllers that used to, you yeah. used to be able to see the parts inside of and stuff like that. Well, maybe the true villain of this show is Nintendo. The signal is the signal that is given by me. Mikey, you can't do that! You're not forklift certified, you can't do that! Yo! But the shuriken no. is! The shuriken was. That was actually some Final Destination type shit that the forklift ran into their necks and stabbed them to death. Describing this show as Final Destination is the craziest stretch I have heard in my fucking life, Eden. Yes, you may upgrade your weapon. That's totally unfair! You can't just say- Wait, did you say yes? Ninjas have improved their arsenal for centuries. <laughs> yeah, now we use guns like normal people. Think about this. It could be dangerous. You know what else could be dangerous? Standing between me and my father. Oh, I totally forgot about her and her father. Because she's just been, like, not relevant at all the last two episodes. This is a female-led episode, okay? Think about how politically potent this was in 2012. <laughs> 2012, when women didn't have rights. The Cortexicons! <gasps> What'll we do? What'll we do? Is he watching the same episode? No, I think he just gets slapped. He just slapped gets slapped every episode. every episode of the show. It's just exactly oh, like those shitty old cartoons where they just reuse animation relentlessly. This is the future of ninjutsu. Lego. He made a Lego. Lego ninjutsu. Oh my God, it's real. Fucking dumb idiot girl. She deserves to die, actually. That's like when you're in a lecture and someone drops her hydro flask and it just makes like the most ear shattering noise possible. What the fuck did she think she was gonna accomplish with that? 
Well, looks like she accomplished something she right accomplished there. She accomplished something How? Easily. How? I don't buy this. She's a weak, weak woman. Why can't you just say she's a weak person? Because she has a much lower muscle ratio than Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. Ooh, let's call it Metalhead. Why, you ask? Because it's got a head and it's made of- We get it. I think that might have been the most painful joke in the whole show. Yeah, I can't defend that one. Sorry. I was wondering if I could take Metalhead for a spin tonight. You may. That's totally unfair. You can't just. They did the same joke twice. That's called poetry. It's the rule of thirds, bro. We just have here one more time. <laughs> Raphael is anti AI. The crypto bro versus the Chad normal person. April. Guys. White woman spotted. Can we just talk about how terrible her fit is, though? Can we just roast this trash, trash ass fit right now? Okay, yeah, it's kind of bad. She's got like wrist glove things, and then the short shirt with the long shirt underneath, but it doesn't go all the way. Then she has jorts. Okay, you can't insult the outfit when her face looks like that. Like Unity Engine basic character model. Metalhead is just too clumsy. It'll get in our way. Clumsy? Can we put like a sitcom-esque laugh track after that happened, please? <laughs> yeah, kill the brains. They just don't learn their lesson, man. Look at her. Stop doing that! I'm just glad he's not panning the camera down. That's all I'm gonna say. You do know that's not muted, right? Huh? No! It's not me. Oh my god, this is so cringe. So how do you think the fight's going? <laughs> that timing was so the way funny. The way that her body so just good. flopped over like that. I lost the control signal! What's that crank doing? Ew, ew, ew. That's really gross, to be honest. One thing I don't understand, though, why does he have to be all the way back at home? Why can't he just be, like, on recon, like, in the building yeah, over Yeah, he should be, like, trailing, like, a few behind in person. That's how they do it when they do tests on actual mechanically controlled robots. In fact, most of the time, the range on the controls would not be this far. Maybe if I can override Donatello. You're a fellow. I know, Splinter. I've been a fellow my whole life. Splinter told him, Donatello, you're not a gamer. <laughs> Donatello, touch grass. He's got to have a weak spot. This always works. <laughs> Robots don't have balls? What? There's no way Donnie would make a robot without tech. I find that very unrealistic. They're teenage boys. They would definitely put a penis on that thing. If after this episode, they still don't kill the brains afterwards, I'm just going to lose my shit. The entire reason they are in this conflict is because of the brain. How have you not learned your lesson yet? Because that would be too violent for a children's cartoon. Killer Bean. It's one of a kind. I want Killer Bean. Editor, can you put Killer Bean on the screen instead? Haha, <laughs> I love that scene. Not bad. Not bad for a white guy. Yo, I, I know we're kind of like late in the video right now, but I just wanted to say, Core, your shirt looks fantastic today. Editor, keep that in the video. It's not supposed to do that. Run! Yeah! You say run. And if you guys want us to watch My Hero Academia, then get this video to 12,000 likes. No, don't say 12. <laughs> it's 50,000 likes. <laughs> Alejandro Paredes, Asmus Bioga, Atomic Leon, Bento, Kamlu, Communism is when people's iPhone, Cosmic Dega, Crystal Bunny, Daryl Herb, James, Frozen Spaghetti, Gabriel Granados, Gub, Stargazer, Gummy Brain Rot, Gunny Snow, Jonathan, Helio, I Love Spilling the Milk, Isaiah Alfred, Kamui, Night VDB, Lilac Moon, My Artistry, Master Nate, Misty Skies, Native, Obama Gaming, Omega Waffles, Puffles, Remuel, and Steven Sanchez, Terrence Sills, Useless Grunt, Val Explicit, Wyatt Lime, Yahir Sanchez.